Oh man. Yay! People are here! I appreciate that you guys showed up even though I uh... Okay guys. So we have options. We have intro video or intro video junior or we could go and make another character. We did choose the leaving the room ending. So. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, or we could new game plus. So there's a question. We could new game plus, which um so part of why I want to do this is I want to see how much of a difference player skill makes. Um, part of why I want to do this is because I want to do cool new things. Um, I want to see the stuff that I didn't do last time. Find different people. Maybe uh, get... Uh, is his name Latrec? To talk to me? And then push him off the edge. Um, before he has a chance to kill the uh, fire keeper. Um, and, um, what are the other things that I want to do? I want to try to figure out Petrus's story and see if I can save anyone else. Um, who else is there? I'd love to be able to save. Haha. <laughs> I know, right, Army? Hi, Fuzzy Werewolf. All right, so so we've got a, we've got a couple of options here. We can watch the other ending as a group. Or rather, I can watch it, and you guys can watch me watching it, and we can collectively watch it. Um, if somebody can find me a, a video on YouTube of it that doesn't have like talking over, that's just that. Um, if that is available on YouTube, um, and then we can figure out whether we want to <laughs> figure out what we want to do here with this choice whether we want to give flute mom another run or intro video or intro video junior <laughs> why is intro video level four that's weird why is why is he four and she's one? Warriors start at level four, huh? Okay, so in Dungeon Master, you can either resurrect a character or reincarnate a character. If you resurrect them, they come with their stuff and their levels and their everything. Um, but if you reincarnate them, they start back at like le basically level zero in all of their skills. Um, and so they're like temporarily weaker, but then they wind up stronger in the long run because you got to level them up through that. So they have the stats that they had before, but not the skills. So then you add the stat, the the stats get higher as the skills get higher. Um, so, oh, well, how do we feel about that, friends? I'm going to leave some of this up to you because you guys are willing to come along with me for the ride, apparently, somehow. I'm sorry I can't offer you the coolness of a blind run, and I don't know if we're going to play all the way through this game again, um, but I'm really curious to see what I can do. Um... Do you guys want to see Flute Mom New Game Plus, or do you want to see one of the intro videos, or somebody else? <laughs> I don't know, I think blind runs are pretty fun. I don't know if I want to try a different build. Again, like I said, part of what I want to do with this is to see what a different player skill makes instead of... Um, so that would be like taking the... basically being the same thing that I was. And... There will probably be more Souls adventures in the future. <laughs> Who knew? Who knew? Yeah, we'll see me, but that's not usually what I do. It's not the knowledge of what I'm playing that is the reason why I play games. Um, so, I don't know. 
We'll see. I don't know if my Night in the Woods replay was a good idea or not, but we're going to try this. So, okay. Let me know. You know what I can do? Hold on. I can do this. No, not that. Okay. I can make a poll. Let's make a poll. Voting on what to Probably walking. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Yes, it was from the New World Symphony. <laughs> it's one of my favorites, actually. All right, let us... Okay. Okay, so now you guys can vote. It's very exciting. <laughs> I'm very excited. Um, let's go ahead and watch that video. That somebody, uh, so you have, so you can vote while we watch the first, the recording of the other ending. And when we are done with watching the other ending, then voting will be over. All right, you ready? Okay. Hold on. It's going to take a moment. Uh, processing request. Come on, computer. No, 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 no. Don't crash. Okay. All right. Let me get theater mode. Okay. Wow. It's almost like they, they know that people are going to be streaming things now or something. All right. I don't want to start as deprived. I don't want to play hard mode. Okay. Hold on. Hmm. Hmm. Eh. Eh. Please don't be frozen. Properties. No, not that. Uh, there we go. Hold on. It's going to take a bit to uh, scale this out. Hmm. Give me a moment. Give me a moment. I don't know where it went. Where did it go? Where did it go? There it went. Okay. Oops. Okay. All right. Supposedly... No, not that. Oh my god. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. You guys... Oh, you can't see it. Why can't you see it? Maybe we'll... Default view? No, it's still not working. Hold on. It wasn't... Wasn't... Window moded. Hold on. I'm sorry, guys. I... Ah! No! Technical difficulties. I'm Lauren. Why isn't it working? Ah. Uh, um. There we go. There we go. Got it. Okay, hold on. That worked. Why is Chrome not working? Why is it not working? Oh no. <laughs> That's true, Cyber. Oh my gosh. Guys, what am I doing wrong? You know what we're going to try? 
We're going to try... Uh, wait, hold on. Is it working now? No. Uh... Oh, okay. Uh, why? Ah, ah, ah! Hold on. Here we go. Okay, so we go up to the fire. We become the fire, which I suppose should not surprise anyone. Oh, do you hear the sound? That's the bonfire sound. All right, so is this going to explode outward like what happened to uh, the crispy knights? Yeah, the bonfire is really big. Okay, that answers that. Is that it? Then. Okay, hold on. Hold on, what's it doing? Why is it doing that? Why is it doing that? How do I delete that? Remove. There we go. Okay, I got it. Okay. <laughs> Nested ads indeed. I thought I got rid of it, but I got rid of the wrong um the wrong thing in in my stream. Yeah, I know, right? Ha. Huh. Okay. So, we managed to avoid spoilers thanks to a nested ad. So it's kind of what I expected from that ending, honestly. Um, they make it really clear that, um, <laughs> let's play Vati. Yeah, maybe. Um, yeah, while I heard, I couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't get enough Dark Souls, apparently. All right, so are we done, are we, are we done voting? If anybody else wants to vote, please say, I want to vote. Or please, please vote. Um, what's the, what's the thing? How do I shut down a vote? Vote. Pull. All right. I'm gonna close it. Notify chat. Sorry. All right. Well, apparently you guys don't want to see New Game Plus. Apparently you guys want to see New Game, um, which is going to be Intro Video Junior. Oh, I should, shouldn't I, while I heard? Oh my god, I feel like we should like celebrate with that. My goodness. Well, we have made a decision, which it looks like, um, it looks like the game anticipated that decision. Yes, we will reset the death counter. Are you ready for that? Are you ready to reset the death counter? Here, let me, oops. Go here, counter, 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 counter. Okay, so we're gonna, oops, oh man. So here is the death count as it was for Flute Mom. <laughs> yeah, no, well, come on, it was, it was, I believe, saved at the end of our previous one, but, uh, you ready? Oh, goodness, okay, that does sound a lot harder. I don't know that I'm looking for that much of a challenge, and as long as there's not a lot that I can only do in New Game Plus, the previous stream, I think, had this number here, so 355. This is the final tally. We are now going. There we go. 
crazy. 355. See how many times we can die here. Oh, is that why people play New Game Plus 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 Plus? Did I go up to seven or something like that? All right, guys, we're gonna play Intro Video Junior. <laughs> Which is somehow funnier than Intro Video being the one that we're playing. You know? All right, so we've watched the intro video several times. We've seen enough of the intro video. I think we all know how it goes. The one thing I haven't fully solved from the intro video that I know of is the role of the furtive pygmy. So I'm just gonna say, um, No, because Blues, I want to I wanna do a direct comparison. But the part of the point of this is, um, is skill, um, player skill. That's what I want to see. <laughs> but there was the one thing I don't know for sure is the furtive pygmy, but I know that the furtive, I think the furtive pygmy has to do with humanity. And so there's been some really interesting conversations. You think so, Sims? But then how am I going to talk to uh, our fair lady. You can? Oh good, okay, because yeah, that's my concern. Should we get the master key? We can do that. Alright. Okay, interesting. I didn't know that. Well, in that case, I guess we can make somebody new. Okay. But I'm not going to be speed running. Oh my god, so many indecisions. What am I going to do? I don't know, Fuzzy. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how long it takes. I mean, it's taken me like half an hour to get to the point of loading up the game or starting up the game. What shall we name this character? Oh, oh, oh. Oh my god. All right. All right, so should what, should Flute Child be a boy or a girl? <laughs> I'm so delighted that we're playing Flute Child! <laughs> oh my god. Let's do Flute Child. <laughs> Twoot, Mom. <laughs> That's pretty good, Goat Mom, actually. I find that very charming. Um... Um, you guys aren't voting on this, so I'm gonna have to make a decision. Well, I tend to prefer to play as girls when given the option, but you'll notice that Flute Child is an ambiguously gendered name, so it could go either way. <laughs> Nobody cares. All right, we're gonna go with the Pyromancer again because I like the Pyromancer. So we're gonna go with the Master Key. Physique. Oh man. <laughs> Why is this an option? Why is Tiny Head? It's funny watching the like body shape and strange. Um. I feel like we should we should go with this. I don't know why. I don't know. Uh, 
Now I know what these places are. So Katarina is what I want. Because I like Katarina. What kind of a hair color, or what kind of hair should she have? I think pigtails is cute. Oh, right, I can spin her around. <laughs> Thanks, Armored Gorilla. Oh, I like that. Plus, this one with a description. Why would you do that? I don't know that I'm going to skip over that much. Okay, actually, though, I like this one the best. We're going to go with that. Hair color. Okay, she looks cool. That is possible, Sartaki. <laughs> I tried to break the cycle, and yet here I am again. Okay, well, we could make her really childlike. Let's customize her a little bit more. Um. Hold on. We'll make her look like a child. I mean, it doesn't super matter. So that's gonna be a weak chin. Oh my god. No. Let's see. What is this same different? Oh, no, that's not what I meant to do. What? No. Oh, my D-pad and I. Okay. Maturity, young. Let's go with uh, slightly weaker features. Make her look a little bit younger, maybe. What do you think? I mean, we can change her hair color, but I really like this. I mean, oh, pause this. We give her this. What do you think of red hair? Do you think red hair suits her? Dark red. Dark blue, gold, silver. All right, we're all in agreement about that then. But you can customize even more. Oh, that's too much power. The hair color has lore? I didn't know that. That's dangerous. Why are my eyebrows purple? I think she's pretty cute. What do you think? I could make her a serious monster if I wanted to. We could give her some more cheeks. Oh goodness, that's too much cheek. <sighs> Beef jerky face, really, yeah. Pretty well, Edward, actually. Hmm. Yeah, well, Lobos is a goof. Let's see. Eyes. Ah. Uh, oh, we'll make the eyes a little bit bigger. That'll make her seem a bit younger. That's maybe too much. That that dates into a. Oh, interesting, Sartaki. I didn't know that. Yeah, no, um, Ormi, the, the person that I watched uh, play the game before uh, did that and was somewhat frustrated by it. OK. 
Okay. Not like we're gonna see much of her, but. Oh, wow. Oh my God, fake eyes like a basilisk. Oh my God, armor gorilla, that's terrifying. Are they really that bad? I mean, we can make them a little bit smaller. Oh my god. I mean, I don't think that she's going to be very realistic. I mean, we could we could we could go all all out. <laughs> As somebody with really big eyes myself. That's creepy. Lip fullness. Smaller lips. Uh ah, I see. Because I want to uh There we go. Ah! No! What did it just do? No! Ah, are you serious? Do I have to start all the way over? Or, well... Oh my god, I do. I'm sorry, guys. Maybe we'll just use the mouse for that part. Customize. All right. Eyes a little bit bigger, a little bit wider. I'm sorry, guys. This is probably not very. gonna do this what just happened why did it do that no it was it was 355 did it just reset oh my god really not clear oh oh my god I'm sorry guys We're done, for real. Okay, so do I hit customize? This is it, right? Or do I hit initialize? 
Oh, exit the menu. Oh! Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. I, but I just didn't customize my character, Sataki. We're gonna start the game with Flute Child. Thank you guys for your patience. In the age of ancients, the, the previous world age. was unformed, shrouded by fog. Hmm. A land of grey crags, arch trees, and everlasting dragons. So there's dragons. So they just sit there. They don't do anything. But then there was fire. And it was fire... Came disparity. We're going down the Great Hollow. Heat and cold. Life and death. And of course, light and dark. Then from the dark they came. See, like, are these? These look undead. These look like hollows. Hollows that were dark. And then some of them found souls of lords and turned into the people that we know and love here. So does that mean that Nita was the first one who took it? The Witch of Isolin and her Daughters of Chaos. Yeah, that would make sense, Ivy. The Lord of Sunlight and his faithful knights. We know those guys. And the furtive pygmy, so easily forgotten. Yeah, that one's definitely human. With the strength of lords, they challenged the dragons. But why? Wind's mighty gods peeled apart their stone skins. The witches weaved great firestorms. Nito unleashed a miasma of death and disease. He's his his whole like like hairy cloak thing is kind of weird. Seath, you are the most bad. So there's all the dragons dead. A giant pillar of them. Not pillar, um, Thus pyre. began the age of fire. But soon the flames will fade. And only dark will remain. Hence the age of dark, which is what I... I started last time. Even now... Sees not light, but only endless nights. And amongst the living are seen carriers of the accursed dark side. I still am not entirely clear on the chronology of things. It's uh <laughs> That's true blues. Um yes, indeed. The dark sign brands the undead. And in this land the undead are corralled and led to the north. So this land, I don't know if they say where or when. That is where they are locked away to await the end of the world. Hmm. So they await the end of the world, and then what? This is your fate. Hmm. 
But I mean, depending on where your character is from, or do they mean all... Oh my god, Sartaki. I don't know if I have the skill for that. Yeah. For all that we gave Flute Child big round cheeks, I don't think she's gonna have... Yeah, I'm just, I'm really curious if the starting place is, is set. Alright, so let's, let's get a look at our, uh... Hello. Hello, flute child. Oh, what? Are you, okay, good. I was gonna say, if you can't smash anything in the first room, that seems disingenuous. So... I did start as a pyromancer. Yeah, the point here for me is to see... So basically they're like, we can't, we can't get rid of them. So we'll just put them here. I'm sorry, buddy. Hello, friend. He's really big. It's no wonder that I have a hard time with him. This person didn't have a good time. Are they trying to tell me that I should run up here? Oh, so you, you mean how long you've been here? Oh, I don't have a shield, do I? Whew, this is going to take some getting used to. So is the idea like that you that you come back having saved the world? I wonder if you can break the cycle. Hi friend. What you doing there? Doesn't look like I mean okay. You're taking a bath. Can't fault you for that. I don't have my shield. Oh man, if I die all the time, having beaten the game, don't laugh too hard at me. Do 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 do. Okay. Oh, hello, bonfire. Oh, right! It has to explain to you how to play the game. Yes, I shall play the game. I shall light the bonfire. S oh, wow, bonfires are tiny right now. So, like, what we do... Huh, you can hear him stomping around. Wow. I do not have much stuff. Um... So, like... I'm still trying to puzzle through this game, okay? That's true, there is one human who's not undead. And I know who she is! And I feel really bad for her and I hope she gets out of there alright. All right, I'm gonna die. It's gonna be terrible. Okay, I think I remember the direction that I want to go. Or maybe I could just not do this. How does that sound? What if I just do that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, that is nice. That is so much nicer. I was actually getting anxious. I was like, am I gonna die at the very beginning? I'd be really embarrassed. Okay, no, but so I'm really confused about, like, I'm still really confused about the timeline of things. And it's interesting that we as the undead light the bonfires the same way that we then uh, uh, kindle uh, 
the first flame and then get consumed by it. I kind of wonder whether the bonfires, I mean, there's definitely like we draw energy from the Estus that is clearly from the bonfire. Um, but does the bonfire take from us as well? Um, like to a lesser degree than the first fire because the first fire is the biggest so it takes the entirety of us. Do the small bonfires take a small bit of us? Um, and like are those like the remains of somebody or something in particular? I don't know. Get a shield, they say. Existential zombie crisis, yes. You do offer humanity to them. There have been some really interesting conversations. You feed off of Gwyn's essence each time you fill up. I don't know. I don't know. I'm like... I feel like I'm so close to being able to wrap my head around something. Oh wow, I have like no health. What if I leave you alone and get equip my axe? But I have to run to safety to do it because I'm Lauren. Maybe he's going to come back. So do you... So you use the firekeeper's souls to be... to have more... No, that's... That's true, Armored Gorilla, but I... What is it that you get to uh, be able to... Does this put me out with the boss again? I don't want to do that. I'm going to do this. No, this one doesn't? Okay. <laughs> sometimes cyber, sometimes they're actually really funny. Like, sometimes people find really clever ways to communicate ideas. Oh, hello! 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 Hi, I see you there! Oh, I see you are not talking to me. I wanna... Ah, how do I go talk to my friend? I wanna talk to friend! 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 I don't remember. It's been a year and a half. It may be that as I play through this game, I decide that I don't actually want to play through it again. Quinn or bust. Oh, that's to go fight the boss again, isn't it? What if I don't? <laughs> right! Right, 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 right. I vaguely remembered that. <sighs> but I didn't know if this was that part. Because I thought it took longer to get to that part, but I guess it probably did last time. Ah. Uh. Oh, you. You're no hollow. Thank goodness. I'm done for, I'm afraid. I'll die soon. Then lose my sanity. I wish to ask something of you. You and I are both undead. Hear me out, will you? <laughs> Regrettably, I have failed in my mission. 
but perhaps you can keep the torch lit. There is an old saying in my family. You can keep the torch lit. Thou art undead, art chosen. In thine exodus from the undead asylum, make it pilgrimage to the land of ancient lords. When thou ringeth the bell of awakening, the fate of the undead thou shalt know. Well, now you know. And I can die with hope in my heart. Oh, one more thing. Here, take this. An Esther's flask. An undead favorite. Oh, and Oh my god, <laughs> it keeps going. Now I must bid farewell. I would hate to harm you after death. So go now. Did I come back and Thank fight him? Because if I didn't, I probably will. Now I must bid farewell. I would hate to harm you after death. So go now. And thank you. Use item. Ah, yes. <sighs> yeah, it seems that there have been several storylines that were cut. I guess we can go. Is this the right way? Doesn't look like it. Lauren, oh my god. So... So I'm actually feeling really anxious right now and it's obviously, as I'm sure you can tell, a very different anxiety than the uh, first time that I played this game. Um, which I guess would make sense. Yeah, Isolith does seem like it is much more, uh... Oh! What just happened? Who just died? Oh, that was Oscar. Oh my god, are you serious? Rusting at bonfire revives enemies. Hey, my pyromancy flame. Oh, they don't want you to have your pyromancy flame. What's this? So, what does... Ah! Crap. What does that drop if you're not a pyromancer? Okay. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay, or a talisman, that makes sense. I was gonna say. Behind an enemy critical hit. Oh my god. Right, the shield is not nearly as good as mine. Two can play at that game. Bar. What? Nothing? What is where does this go? Well, Fearsome shriveled knight. What does this one say? Right. Oh man, parrying. Okay, so. So I'm just looking around here. So Oscar knows something about keeping the flame lit. That's what he tells you. Hey, buddy. <laughs> oh, shoot! Oh, 
my god. Okay, well, that wasn't good. Did that happen to me last time? Darn it, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Well, <sighs> it is no accident that you hear something else chomping around, stomping around trompety trompety where you're like wait there's more oh yes there is more okay so to recover we're gonna do what I suspect we did last time and uh, break some jade pots <laughs> oh interesting discipline daddy that's a good, that's a good thought. Okay. Stompy McStomperson indeed. <sighs> Dead wrong. Yeah. So playing without an Estus does not sound like fun. But I'm also not a player who likes things that are particularly challenging. A <laughs> Dead paleo diet. Oh my god. That's amazing. I'm amused. I'm very amused. So now, oh my god, oh my god, you had to beat Calamite without any Estus? I, uh, that's a heck of a thing. I can't even imagine, Calamite was pretty bad. Alright, you can go around in a loop, loop de loop de loop. No, clearly according to game design, obviously I don't remember my way around here. Clearly according to game design, they brought you out here for a reason and now I can do... I don't know what, what France deserves, man. Wait. Oh, now I don't know. Well, I mean, what's the worst that can happen? See, look, there's like... So is this, this is snow covered. I did pick up my pyromancy flame. I haven't equipped it yet though. Good point. Change equipment. Equip the pyromancy flame. It's interesting my characters are right-handed even though I'm a left-handed person. Oh. Oh my god. That is a good question, CB. Where on the DMV like thing of drama, where would Frampt be? Cause for those of you who haven't seen, um, by the way, I've been playing Crisis Core. Um, so if you haven't seen it, I made a uh, drama queen scale to go with the, the undead scale, the scale of deadness. deadness. Um, so we, we place characters on that. Um. Flutie Bot thinks that He's an eight. I mean, he is pretty dramatic. So these are notes from Oscar. That's why it's Oscar's head. Because he's the one who told you about. Ooh. Don't laugh too much if I die, okay? <gasps> what? Wait, is this where I'm supposed to go? 
Hold up. I thought I was going to go up here. Okay, well, whatever. I'm going to go down there. I'm going there because I don't think I did that before. Or at least if I did, I don't remember it. Oh, I picked the wrong way. I did DX man because I wanted to see for myself what my skill increase was. Did I do that last time? Hello. Let's go somewhere else back here. Are you a... Uh, are you are you teasing or serious, Armored Gorilla? I am. I'm Mama Bird. I may be flute child, but I'm Mama Bird. Man, shall we do that? Shall we get a death? Shall we jump off a cliff and get a death? And then see what this does? Might be a technical hang-up. Okay. I mean... Save and reload, yeah, that's... Because I don't want to have another... I don't want to have an unnecessary death up there. We're going to do it! Quick game. Yes. <gasps> Nox. <gasps> little Nox, I love you, little girl. Meow. Oh my god, she yawned. <laughs> a n no death run. Oh man, Flute Child is all the way down here. She's slightly cuter than Intro Video Junior, which is what I intended, was for her to be cuter. Oh man, I'm going to be s You, you, give me warm, give me soft. Uh, hello? Warm and soft. I haven't come across any blankets. How do I do I do I drop items? Can I can I talk to you? I don't see a talk option. Like I at least <sighs> What is down there? I mean death obviously, but Oh really? Very obtuse. How do I? Okay. I assume I probably can't do it yet unless I throw a fireball, which I don't think would be the answer. Here's a cat, by the way. Hi, cat. Knox. So, do I drop items in the nest? Like, is that how you do that? Is Knox? Yeah, well, she kept knocking things off of my desk, and I had a shoebox. So I put the shoebox, because she kept sitting in the shoebox behind me, and I was like, wait. I know. This Nox is going to be in a box instead of knocking things off my desk by sprawling up. Hello, Nox. You want to say hi to everybody? She just says purr. Oh, there's a similar mechanic in Demon Souls. Okay. Yes, she's a box, she's a mouse, she's a nuts. Purr, she's purring really hard. Like, the whole box is vibrating, my hand is vibrating. Alright, Nox, I'll put you back. Oh my gosh, she's a sleeper. Um, so whatever they want, I probably don't have it because I just started the game. Because my items are... <sighs> I don't have very many items. So I assume you get the item they want, which is soft and warm. Uh, and then I drop it. Do I drop it off the ledge? Or do I drop it into the nest? At least I assume one of the eggs is the one that's speaking, since I don't see anyone else. Oh. Oh. I don't think I have anything that I can drop in there.
You know, like I don't, I assume that they don't mean my fireball spell or my pyromancy flame. Which is literally all I have right now. Is Bloodborne a PS4 exclusive? Oh, I guess you get it back then? Oh, you don't get it back. Oh, okay. Well, never mind then. Well, something else that's soft and warm. Unless soft is different. Unless it's like one egg wants soft and one egg wants warm. Hey, Susan. Yeah, see, I couldn't get enough Dark Souls, apparently. I mean... Do I have a humanity? And I guess I don't really pressingly need humanity right now. And I'll get some more eventually. Yeah, well, I figured I would save and reload over there. So do I, like, go to here and then... No. No, Lauren! Buttons! Button, 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 button! So, select. Oh, I can't drop it. Oh, is it because it's got equipped? Right. You would think I would know the basics. So I drop it? Specify quantity. Does that count? It's, it looks like it's in the nest to me. Is that in the nest? Should. Should I put it more in the nest? Hmm. Oh, the hot bar, right, because the hot bar, see, hot is warm. Okay, we're gonna go here. And very safely safe. Try this. Thank you guys for this little bit because that's a little bit of that's a little technicality that I don't think I would have figured out on my own. It's not lore. Oh hey. You you give me warm. Give me salt. Oh my god, that person just jumped off a cliff. Don't do that, buddy. It is. It is not an item I like. It is part of why I hate Kareem so much. That's why we will never come from Kareem. No, we come from Katarina now that I actually know what the locations are. I think last time I was like, I'm playing a pyromancer, so I'll pick the place that pyromancers are from. But whatever. I'm a happy pyromancer. I bet Laurentius would get along well in, in Karina. All right, let us go up here and get taken over. Not taken over like that. Taken Only over the land. In the ancient legends, it is stated that one day an undead shall Ooh. return. That is a big angry bird. To leave the undead asylum in pilgrimage to the land of the ancient lords. I do agree, like they're 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 worshipped as gods. Lordran. This place. Hey, I know this place. Oh man, Crestfallen's still gonna be here, isn't he? Hey, buddy.
Level up and kindle at bonfires, it says. The third crow is delivering you to Lord on behalf of Velka in order to punish the gods. Well, I don't know yet why, um, why Velka would want to punish the gods. Hey, buddy. Oh man, I could level up a couple of times. Let us give ourselves some vit. Vit, 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 vit. Uh, maybe some endurance? Wait. They banished her stuff to the painted world? What stuff? Oh, wait. What? I think I want endurance here. Yeah, that looks good. Wait, no. I am I gonna go dex builds, do you think? <laughs> Alright, let me finish leveling up. We're gonna do that. I don't really want to do magic. Stronger child, yes. Um, did I encounter all of the NPC invaders? I don't know, because I, I don't. I don't know how many there are. I know I encountered several of them. I. Uh, sorry, Sims. Flute <laughs> child can be our rowdy daughter. Yes, Flute Child, let's go say hi to Crestfallen Knight. Can I save you? Can you well, not die? What do we have here? Don't answer that. You must be a new arrival. Let me guess. Fate of the undead, right? Well, you're not the first. But there's no salvation here. You'd have done better to rot in the undead asylum. But too late now. <sighs> well, since you're here, let me help you out. Ah, actually, two bells of awakening. One's up above in the undead church. The other is far, far below, in the ruins at the base of Blight Town. Ring them both, and something happened. Brilliant, right? Not much to go on, but I have a feeling that won't stop you. So, off you go. It is why you came, mm. isn't it? To this accursed land, the undead. <laughs> I am really rather dark. Hmm. I would. I'm. I'm actually probably going to summon more this playthrough. Um. I don't know that I have enough humanity to walk around human all the time. I think I die too many times for that. I saw Mildred. Um. Xanthus or whatever his name is, the the yellow guy, Leroy. Um co-op run indeed oh goodness I just kicked something over well that's all right doesn't matter King Jeremy okay thank you I mean really I think calling him the yellow guy is about as much as the game gives me hi friend ah, your face you're practically hollow but who knows going hollow could solve quite a bit <laughs> he's depressed He's like, maybe we could just not be here, buddy. I'm sorry. Ooh, what? Restoring your humanity. Right, Chester. Well, there are a few ways to go about it. Collect it bit by bit from corpses. Or you can butter up a cleric and get yourself summoned. And the quickest way, although I never do it, is to kill a healthy undead and pillage its humanity. Coveting thy neighbor is only human, after all. <laughs> hmm. I don't like Chester. What are you looking at? Oh, and Mildred, yeah. Forever, you might regret it. Yeah, no, I know. I knew there was one more that I... 
Let's see. What happens if I... What happens if I do? I mean... <laughs> Interesting taste there, Sims. Yes. All right, let's go talk to him. Presumably his dialogue will be different if we've got skin. Oh, look at how cute and happy we are. We're smiling. Yes, what? You want to hear more? Oh, that's all we need. Another inquisitive soul. Well, listen carefully then. One of the bells is up above in the undead church, but the lift is broken. You'll have to climb the stairs up the ruins and access the undead burn through the waterway. The other bell is back down below the undead burn, within the plague-infested blight town. I don't like that place. But I die again before I step foot in that cesspool. Yeah. <laughs> It's like they know, they know everyone's gonna hate that place. He sure does have a lot to say. Bloody hell, what is it now? You ask too many questions. <laughs> oh no, Some, that looks like somebody stole Laurentius's clothing? Or is that just uh, what being a male pyromancer looks is like? Oh, he's not there. And he's not there, but there's water. Man, none of my friends are here. But that's okay. Let us go visit. Well, should we go visit Petrus? I think he's there already. Hi, Petrus. Will you be my friend this playthrough? Hello there. I believe we are not acquainted. I am Petrus of Thoroughland. Have you business with us? If not, I'd prefer to keep a distance, if possible. Okay, he does not want to be my friend. I guess that's a pretty solid answer there, huh? Let's see. So I'm trying to think through and like, I know that I can do all sorts of crazy things as far as, um, uh, what's the word? I could go fight bosses right now, but I don't have the gear. Bye Cyber, thank you. Come on, buddy. Speed run through catacombs and fight pinwheel. Yeah. Oh, I'm definitely a speedrunner type. Oh, that guy wants to stab me so badly. Your friend should really be able to set you on fire. He's not very good at this. Right, my shield doesn't do enough. I'm going to die here and it's going to be embarrassing. Well. I could try learning to parry. Yeah, I know parrying is good, but you know what is not good? Being on fire. You ready to go be on fire? Let's go be on fire. No, no! Ugh! Well, I wasn't on fire. I <laughs> know, right, Medigan? That's all right. Oh, interesting discipline, Daddy. That's... Come here, buddy. Come here. Come on. Well, there's some player skill that I didn't have before. Oh, I assume none of that is really very good, is it? Okay. 
Ah, I'm on fire now. That's not what I wanted to do. Ah, I'm pretty sure that I did some, some something equivalent to this last time around. Come on, buddy. Yeah. Fortunately, these guys aren't very hard, so you can... Okay. Oh no, there goes his item. Darn it. Come here, buddy. Hoop. Hi, buddy. You make me a little bit nervous. So I guess you just can't get items if they fall, huh? Well, too bad for Lauren. A D and D Munchkins playbook. All right, so they've died and left their souls. Isn't there a rat that is in here? Yeah. Is there anybody over here? I don't. I mean, Molly is eventually. Well, let's see what happens if we fight the rat. Oh, jeez, I'm gonna get poisoned and die. No, maybe not. Maybe if you weren't such a pessimist, Lauren, you'd do okay. Well, I'm definitely less afraid than I was last time, which may or may not be a good thing, you know? Oh. Doesn't open from this side, huh? Blues, are you present? If not, I can I can do the death count. There's supposed to be a way. Tears, huh? Where are you? There's supposed to be a way for me to set it so that the fluty bot, um, so that that part of fluty bot can be handled by people who are who are designated as regulars, instead of just being mods. But I haven't been able to figure that out yet. What does this one say? Ha! What happens if you roll off that ledge? I guess there's a thing there. Oh, jeez! You set me on fire! That's precisely what I don't want. Two can play at that game. Oh, I forgot that I could have set those other guys on fire. Oh, am I here already? I do seem to recall this whole area taking much longer and being much harder. What if I just do this? It's going to be like nothing... Ah, that's not a lot. Now what do I do? Can I hop somewhere? I guess I can hop here and hope I don't die. Is this where I came from? No, it's not! Oh, hello. Come on. Whoo! Okay. So player skill does seem to be making a visible difference, doesn't it? That's not the way to go up to get murdered by a black knight, is it? Oh, those are crispy knights! The black knights are crispy knights. Oh no, crispy knights, I'm so sorry. Oh, hey buddy. What are you doing? What are you doing, friend? Friend doesn't know. Friend doesn't know what he's doing. Hey! 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 Not a clue. That's all right. More than a bonfire head. Okay. Man, downside of coming in here is that you can't uh, just teleport back to Firelink if you decide that you don't want to be in here. Upside, 
is that I can summon friends to help however much I want now without feeling like a failure. Praise the sun. Always praise the sun. Did I skip a significant chunk of this area? Did I do did I do it wrong? By rolling down there. Hey dudes. Come on. I know that was pretty rude of me, wasn't it? Oh, great rubbish! Thank you, thank you. That was a that was a, a very precious treasure that you've gifted me with. Game, I, I will treasure it forever. I wouldn't say a sick multi kill. I just I I killed the guys who were dangling over the edges. Oh, some of the dudes just died. That's warm and soft rubbish, huh? So can you just go back to the birds anytime you want? Oh, that doesn't look like a trap at all. Hmm. Hmm. Dude. Dude, I see you there. You want to kill me so badly. Okay. Oh, I do need the elevators. You're right. Well, I'll get there. Humanity. Yeah. Look at me. Run, 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 run. Oh, is this where I came from? Hmm. Yes. So I guess the idea is that they then slide back this way. But that's where I came from, right? Do I really want to do that? Why is my sense of direction so messed up? Hmm. This one could be an axe run, maybe. Hmm. I feel like I should just summon friends all the time. I could make boss weapons. That's true, I could make a boss weapon. Hmm. I guess the, this whole thing is here, and that dude is there to encourage you to do that. So I guess I've done that. We're all good. Now I go through here, I look for a bonfire. Isn't the gargoyle ta tail axe super not good? So we're going to find a bonfire after we finish wrecking everything in sight, which is, as you know, the true purpose of video games. Flutiebot wants to make sure that you guys have been stretching, taking care of yourselves. <laughs> That's true. Weird, weird is good. I'm not quite at Android levels of... Of, of fighting with weird things though. Maybe if I, oops, wind up knowing my way around really well. Okay, so this is not a boss. Yeah, but there's gonna be more dudes in here. Who's here? I know Proto used the spider leg at some point in one of the times that I summoned him. And he was trying to get me to guess what it was because he thought it was cool. That is not a bridge. I can't go that way. That is a wall. Guys, what if I don't fight the dragon? 
I was lucky though last time Android made it easier for me. All right, I don't remember where the dragon went. I think I'm not at the dragon yet, right? Right. Hey, buddy. Dragon is after the Taurus demon, which is the one fight that I don't know anything about because that that was the um that was the one where um Android annihilated it with the corn dog of fury. Oh no, you guys! There's bad guys coming and arrows. I think I'm a lot better at this game than I was last time. What do you think? Bye, Proto! Do I want to open that? Probably. First, I want to take out this guy. Blech. Somebody's throwing fire at me. I don't like that. I'm certainly less cautious than I was the first time around. That sounds like a better shield than what I've currently got. <laughs> yeah, I can see that, CB. But um, I appreciate everybody... Um, Respecting my, oops, respecting my preference to not have spoilers. Ah, here we go. So there's a bonfire around here somewhere, isn't there? Yes, there is. Hello, friend. Who wants, does anybody want to get summoned and walk with me through this? Do you guys mind if I summon friends? At this point, like, I... I know what I'm doing. I don't know if anybody has a character low enough level to be summoned by me, right? Isn't that the thing you have to be within? Aha! <laughs> well, let's level up. Make life a bit easier for folks. Rest a bonfire, level up. Vit, 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 vit. I, I think I did. I had a hard time. Yeah, no, I, I probably should, Fuzzy. I probably should. I'm really close to a level. Maybe I'll grind a teensy bit. Come here, buddy. That's okay, DX man. Wow, things things definitely go better when you're like less afraid. Wow. Oops, that hurt. I think I have enough to level now. Merchant. Oh man, where was that buddy? I don't remember where he was. Okay, we are going to level up again. Where? Oh! 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 I vaguely remember him, actually. Yeah. Hold on. Oh, what? I thought that guy was down. All right, Lauren, you need to actually recover. I took the master key because that was what was recommended to me for a replay. <clears throat> Holy crap. Yeah, I can do this. Oops. I don't know if I feel like being evil and killing people. Then again. Oops. 
Well, that wasn't good for me. Oh, does the starting gift have something to do with whether you're evil or not? Yes, burn a nation indeed. Hmm. Sorry, I just, I can't leave boxes, you know. Good luck, it said. Oh, he's through there. Is there something scary down here? I never did go back to say hello to this guy, did I? Last time, did I? Just ahead. Try attacking. Are they trying to get me to be evil? Well now, you seem to have your wits about you. Hmm? Then you are a welcome customer. I trade for souls. Everything's for sale. <laughs> so he and Molly are close to being um, hollow, but her eyes are actually glowing red. So. Hmm. Fight with impunity. I guess, I guess they have that so that they can bring the undead and lock them up, right? That's okay. Hold on. You gotta give me a moment. Is it only the one death or have I died twice now? Is there anything here that is worth getting? I probably don't need that. I mean, I suppose I could buy a weapon that isn't garbage. East-West shield. Hmm. This shield is specialized for parrying. That's not for me. I want this! Okay, so I have to get a thousand souls. What a waste of time. Whatever, buddy. I'm going to get that shield and I'm going to be back. How did I get it last time? Did I buy it last time? Did you guys tell me to buy it? I had it for a long time. I thought it was really good. And I keep forgetting that my shield doesn't do 100% reduction. So I might as well get a shield that does 100% reduction. I don't know if I can handle the, the Valley of Drakes right now. Like, player skill will do some things, but I don't think my player skill is up to that. Oh, jeez! There's two of you! Oh no, I'm gonna die. Oh jeez. Whoo! Bleh. Titanite shard. That seems like that's pretty good at this point. <laughs> All right, fair, Sotaki. All right. The weapons in the graveyard. Oh, that's true. I'm willing to die for those. Come on, buddies. Oh, you know, actually, never mind. I don't feel like fighting you guys. Oh, wait. Do you guys feel like fighting me? Oh, no, you do. Okay. Well, that's all right. Whoo, I got you with your shield down. Okay, well that worked. I don't know if I want to kill the merchant. That seems pretty evil. 
Did the boxes stay smashed from when I smashed them? Let us buy this shield. Oh, still keeping your mark. Then go ahead. Never hurts. Just <laughs> this guy's a jerk. All right. So I did choose to embrace the darkness. That's true. I don't know if I could actually stomach playing an evil run though. Yeah. Thank you. Sorry. This guy is absolutely that kind of a guy. Thank you kindly. <laughs> we are playing Flute Child. That's better. My sword may be terrible, but my shield is good. Does anybody want to get summoned? Or do I have any friends around? Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Sutaki. I did DX men. Yeah, I wanted to break the cycle, which seemed like a good idea. Oh, so there have been some interesting conversations that have happened. Um, because of that. There have been some very interesting conversations. Um, there have been people who have suggested that, um, part of the thing, the disconnect may be, like, it's kind of like an Eastern thing and a Western thing as far as like worldviews and the idea of things being cyclical. So in the uh, individualistic, like individual focused uh, Western society, like you don't want there to be a cycle. You want to be original, break the cycle, blah, blah, blah. And then people are like, well, have, if you think about it, like what's the best for the greatest number of people? What's the best for your community? Keeping people alive and having hope, even if you're limping along, is better. The known, I guess in a way, kind of like the known safety is better than the unknown danger, I think, is kind of the thing um, that people are talking about, which I think is very interesting, personally. Um, so... I don't know. Oh, I could kindle fire here. I mean, I'm probably not going to. Hi, Nox. You're on the floor now. Hi. Hi. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. I'm distracted by how cute my cat is. Yeah, and I like... I did start talking according to that perspective. I, I chose the, the more Western ending. The, like, I'm going to break the cycle, be an individual, like, you know, like, move on to the strange unknown go where no one has gone before it is interesting though as an age of dark um if one were to say that the age before fire was darkness then it could be returning to that part of the pattern i think one of you guys said that this this stream um i don't know there's a lot of possibilities there um <sighs> captain kirk with the boat that skin yeah I mean, I would love to say that I'm more like Picard, smart, reserved, um, responsible, mature, professional, all of those good things. But I'm really just contrary. I don't like being told what to do. I will do a thing if you tell me I can't do it. And that's more like Kirk. <laughs> oh my god, Sims. I don't know what we'll do if there's a, a Sims who's not a, not a wizard. Yeah, I guess it is. You can't have darkness without light. So, that's for Sertaki. Shall we? Shall we reverse hollowing? Shall we summon a friend? Let's do it! Bring. I mean, I'm inclined to like Locke from the name. Haha. <laughs> I'm interested, Ormi. Do you want to elaborate on that a bit? Oh. Wait, is Archer the one from Enterprise? The, uh, the, the prequel of sorts? Because I was watching that, and it was adorable. Oops, I got hit. Oh, right, I actually have a shield that can block things now. Bleh. Praise the sun. Always praise the sun. Alright. Who is this? Is this Sims? Sims! Alright, Sims, let's do it! Yeah, he seems... Oh, goodness gracious me! This guy came around. Hello! 
What dark spirit has invaded? Is this somebody I know? Why are they not taking damage? Summoning failed again. So I got invaded, but I can't summon. Is that the sound it normally makes? Because I never hit Android, so I don't remember. Damn it! Oh my god. Okay. Come on up here. Oh no! How come that didn't do any damage? Oh, because they're uh, they're uh, they're unequipped. Oh! What are you trying to do? No! I'm not good at this. This person uh, is trying to teach me. Hey, MPO! Yeah, it's been a while. How do you parry? Like that? Did that work? Oh! Okay, I, I honestly suspect that that person would consider that uh, successful. That's really adorable. That person was trying to teach me what to do. I could tell I didn't know what I was doing. And I totally learned how to do, okay. We're gonna go, we're gonna go kindle this fire, right? Or should I not kindle this one? I'm trying to remember. They're like, hey, that section's really annoying. Summon a friend. That's fair. Hmm. All right, so that was successful. I learned how to do a thing. Now I have my full fire back and my full Estus. Let's try this again, Sims. I seem to recall I failed at summoning a little while ago. And maybe my game has just decided no summons for me. I Oh hey, Sims made it! Yay! 
Hi, Keller. Yeah. Oh my god, was that you, Armored Gorilla? Thank you. That's really cute. I learned how to do a thing. So thank you for that. Alright, Sims. I don't remember what else is down here. Aww. Are you a priest? You look like a cleric. Like with like a mace and everything. Oh, we have the same shield. Look at us. Oops. Oop. There we go. I got it. I kicked. I kicked. Yeah, well, like, I would be really excited if I were the sort of player that did well with... Yeah, smashing things is the best. I knew there was a guy in here somewhere. I just couldn't remember exactly where until I got closer. Um, I would love to be able to use Ricard's weapon. Yeah, Gwyn is, at least according to the, like, bazillion signs I saw. Hi, Darius. Oh, man. I'm not doing super great. Okay, so the verdict is... Did you just heal yourself with magic? I mean, you're still a caster. Did I say Ricard's name wrong? Because I thought that's how you said that name. That's like Ricardo. It's not Rickard, like Richard. Oh, there's a thing over there! Oh, can I do it? Can I do it? It's going to be like, you should jump. Okay, hold on. Will I die if I fall? No. Ha ha! Is it? Hey! Oh wait, I can do that too. I can wave. Yes! And look at us smashing things as we go. Okay. Oh, I was gonna smash those. Oh man, my, all I know about Monster Hunter is that it's doing a thing with Final Fantasy XIV right now, which I actually play. Ooh, stuff. Yeah! Oops. Did you just die? No. You didn't die. You're killing things. That's much better for you than dying. I'm helping. Oh, really, Caller? The reason why I like it is because I can play it a couple of times a week, or a couple of times a month, and I'm fine. Rah! Oh, man! You did a good job! Yeah, because if, if, uh, if it was the English version of the name, it would just be Richard. So I assumed that it was Ricard. I know this area. I've been told that uh, WoW is a whole lot more of a time commitment than 14, which apparently will like yell at you if you play too much of it. So I play 14 a, a couple of times a month, sometimes once a week with my friends. There have been times that I've played it multiple times a week, but those were rare. Oh, wait, what are we doing back here? That's true, Fuzzy Werewolf. I, 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 I totally respect the decision to not play MMOs. I play 14 because it is how I keep in touch with my friends in Texas.
Like, basically, all of my friends in Texas play it. And so I can play with them. Oh my god, th was, was this area not, like, ridiculously much harder for me? When I, uh, when I, like, I seem to recall, like, I could not get past that. And, like, yeah, Sims is here to help, but not, like, that much, I don't think. Wow! This took me so much longer last time. Holy crap! Like, I'm like, whatever. There's some dudes. I guess we'll fight some dudes. And granted, I've got a friend here, which makes it less emotionally stressful, but still. Fuck, firebomb. <laughs> Apparently, Sir Taki. Well, I mean, that's... That's honestly part of what I wanted to do here, was see, you know, how much better at the game am I now. Did I go the wrong way? Did I go- wait, I'm stuck. I'm confused. I'm confused. Hold on. So that's where we came from. This is- oh, is this a dead end? This is a dead end. Oh, there's a dude. Oh, there was a dude! And Sims killed it. Thank you, Sims! Is this where we came from? Should I go through there? What are we doing? Where can we go? What's happening? Oh, is this a staircase? This is a staircase. Okay. I figured it out. Oh, it's these guys. Oh, hey, I know this place. I know this place. I've been here before. I mean, granted, it's been like a year and a half, so... Oh my god, this game is not nearly as hard as it used to be. Gravity! Goodbye. Shortcut to Cappy, and by that I assume you don't mean, uh, uh Captain America. Oh, I guess, yeah, we can just do that. Oh, hey. This is about halfway through my third two plus hour video on the first run. Gold pine resin, okay. Hey, Sims. Oh, I'm sorry. I feel like I should probably heal you some too. So, like, this, it's interesting because this used to be a house that people lived in, clearly. There's not a way up from here, right? This is just for that, right? I mean, I guess you could just, like, walk down there or something. I don't know. I'm not very good at remembering the specifics. I just know that I've been here before. Is this? Is that where there's a crispy night? Is there a crispy night up there? And if so, do you think we can take one? Well, I thought you were dead. Oh, these guys. Oh, crap. I had a hard time with them. Hang on. Blech. Now, CB, are you saying that because you think so or because you'd like to see me try? Is it down there? Um. Should we do that? What does this say? Praise the sun? Gorgeous view? Question mark. Yes, gorgeous view. Hold on. I'm trying to figure out. <gasps> yep. I knew there was a thing there. I couldn't remember if it was a ball or what, but it turns out that it was a flaming pillar. Not pillar. Uh, barrel. Tight night shard. I'm not that good at backstab. Oh, actually, no, I, I backstabbed a lot of crispy nights, didn't I? Lots of crispy nights. A barrel could be a pillar, yeah. 
Wait. Wait. This is where you fight Havel! Isn't it? Isn't this where you fight Havel? I don't think that's a good idea. I don't think I'm... I don't think I have enough stuff to survive him. If you remember, I cheesed it last time. And yeah, MPO, I... I tr not only did I try it, I tried it and I won. I beat the game last week and we are... <laughs> so this is the actual boss through here, right? I'm not that good at parrying or backstabbing. Oh, it's that guy! Got it. Oh, okay. I knew there was one around here, actually. Yeah, no, the lore, MPO, the lore is what uh, enticed me to do it. Oh, man. Okay. So we ha I know, Havel's ring is really great. We have a couple of possibilities, and by a couple I actually mean three, which is not the same as a couple, which actually is very specifically two. We have the actual boss we're supposed to fight, which will make it so I can't summon help. The crispy knight downstairs, and Havel, who I don't feel like, I feel like I'm like level four, I have like no gear. What should we do, man? Well, I want my friends to be able to continue hanging out with me, so let's not fight the boss just yet. Sims, you want to try Havel? You think we can do it? We ready? All right! We're gonna do this. All right, we're ready. This is gonna be hard. Because you're not supposed to do this yet. If you guys will remember, I totally cheesed fighting him last time. Oh man, Havel, whose backstory is absolutely fascinating. Oh, I did learn to roll between then and now. Maybe that'll make a difference. Maybe. I'm probably going to die a lot. It has good combat and very good lore. Um, so if you don't care about spoilers, I'm going to be talking through this character who we're about to encounter because he's really interesting. When you first encounter him, you think he's gone hollow and his friend, one of the gods, locked him up here for his own good so he didn't go killing people. But actually, um, then you think, oh no, it turns out that um, the god... Uh, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, here he comes, here he comes. Oh no, okay. Jeez, he's so scary. He's like ridiculously tough. But no, so it turns out that actually the, the god who was his friend, he may have tried, then you find out he might have tried to kill the god, and you wonder what the deal is with that. Oh my god, we can't do like any damage, can we? Oh my god. Wow. Um. Oh, jeez! Nope! Ah, uh, no, Lauren, you can't... You can't... Ah... Uh, okay. Okay. Because I just don't do enough damage to really do much good against him. Okay, well, um... I have some... Maybe. Maybe. Oh my god, somebody's just like chilling, rocking by the fire. 
Yeah, just, I feel like I need to be able to do a little more damage than seven. But... Yeah, I guess that's not the, like, overwhelming hardness of it, as it is, um... Hang on, I'm gonna summon Sims. Oops. And if anybody else wants to get summons tonight, let me know. No, but I think I was doing eight damage to him. Don't go off the cliff. Oh, I can't call you Flute Mom. I gotta call you Flute Child. Oh no. Hold on. <sighs> Sorry guys. I just crashed. Computer? Are you... I mean the computer's pretty warm, but... Mm, it feels like it's... Then again, it did crash earlier today. We'll go through and clean it out again. But let's see what we can do. I'm still online, right? Right, I guess that's true, CB. I can work on that. Okay. Well, this has been quite a weird... I'm sorry. Summoning poison? Was that a problem before? I'm not still online, thanks, CB. Oh, no! Oh, I'm so sorry, Armored Gorilla. I would love to bring you in, but if that's what happened last time, the same way. Oh, man. Yeah, see? Do we've got all? They're a family. Look at how cute they are. Oh my god. They're so adorable. I'm outrageously delighted by the fact that I have a family here. Flute mom. Okay, so... I should be able to summon... I know, right? Precious baby children. Okay, well I can't summon just yet. So I'm gonna fight some more dudes. Yes, it, it would it would appear that way. Um, Maya, this button has stopped working. <clears throat> important. I might not be able to proceed with this. Oh my god. My RB button broke. <sighs> oh my god. So I've had... No, it's not my shield. It's my it's my light attack. Maybe Sims, maybe. Maybe the thing is is uh Yeah, it's a little bit important. This would be the most interesting reason why I've had to shut down a stream in a long time. have another plug up here. I do have another plug up here. Alright, let's plug it in. Oops. I've still got Proto's birthday balloon here. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. I died it several months ago, actually, um, and it, it, it's a different shade. Yeah, I know. No, it's broken. 
It's broken. My RB button is broken. Can you fix? Can I don't have to buy a new controller. Keyboard run. I yeah. Well, I thought at first my controller might be broken, but then I was like, no, I walked around. Summon a new controller. I would if I could. Dance Dance Revolution input. Yeah, unlikely. <laughs> controller does want me to play Talos Principle instead. Uh, yeah, I wonder if I'll be able to beat Crisis Core. I don't remember. Oh, wait, no, you use the bumpers to... I mean, I guess you can just use the left bumper and cycle between, um, between things. Well, that's an anticlimactic end to our Dark Souls stream for the night, but I don't think we can proceed. Help. Help, friends. It's working here. I don't think it has a mode button. Let's try this again. Oh my god. I want my wolf ring back. Oh, that's funny when you watch them fall down dead. No, but see, when we switch that, then it tries the attack button there. Okay. Why did that happen? Uh... Record that, record from now, start broadcasting, turn camera on, no broadcasting, turn game mode on. All right, yeah. Oh my god. This is like the worst. Okay, exit the game. Unplug the controller. Controller's unplugged. It should be making the, like, you plugged it in or you unplugged it in thing. Okay. Now let's try that again. How do you check your key settings? <sighs> PC settings. Key settings. That's not controller settings. Does it usually have controller settings there?
I'm sorry, guys. How do you do controller settings in Steam? Flute child looks so happy. The children are much happier than the parents. It's working! Alright then. It's working. Apparently. I don't know how or why. But it's working, so that's cool. I want to be able to summon my friends. Instead, I'm probably going to get invaded again. <laughs> yes, there you go, Sims. That's it. It's the complicated flow of time in Lordran. All right, let me go recover. Why are we tomatoing things in Dropsy? I guess that's a very Dropsy thing. Look, Flute Child is... I, you know, I haven't played... I, I don't play Smash. I haven't played Smash since, uh... Uh... GameCube? So... Alright, Sims, we're gonna do this. Are you ready, my friend? I did not realize that dude was going to do that. But dude did that. Alright, Sims! Yay! Is there anyone else in the vicinity who wants to get summoned? Look at us, look at us dance! Look at how cool we are! Oh man, if I fall off the cliff right there, I'd be very sad. Man, and I've died at least once, and I need to update the death counter. Oh, right, I forgot that you were here, buddy. Uh, well, should we go and try Havel again? That's not the way to go. Hold on, sorry. I forgot. I got mixed up a little bit. Boop, 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 doop, doop, doop. Okay, so we can't go through there. So we have to go through this way. Which is up here. Or this guy's gonna come out here. They're not gonna come out here. Oh, it's those guys! The ones up here! Those are the ones throwing the firebombs down there. Oh, jeez, I'm gonna die. Hold on. I don't remember the deal with that fog wall. No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, jeez! He threw it at a pillar and I walked into the pillar so that I took damage. That was not my finest moment. I don't remember what the deal with that fog wall was. What was the deal with that fog wall? Future shortcut, okay. Who the heck is sh Oh, I remember who's shooting. They're up at the top of the tower. Oh, well they were up at the top of the tower. It sounds like Sims took care of them.
Oh, jeez. I'm so bad at those guys. Thank you, by the way, for taking out the archer. Yeah, so the thing with Dark Souls is that if you want to do it perfectly, I, it can be very frustrating, I think. But if you... Is this thing going to come down here again? Or is it done? It's done. Okay, so it's a one-time thing. Um... We want to try Havel again. If you embrace the fact that you're going to die a whole bunch, it's a lot less frustrating. You want to do it, Sims? Somebody else had said they wanted to be summoned. I don't remember who you were. Yeah, no, I've encountered, I've encountered um, whether you've been invaded or you've summoned somebody. There are fog walls that are temporary. I thought there was something special about that. Oh, thank you. Uh. Oh, man. Oh, no, Sotaki. Well, I could grind a little bit, which might not be a bad idea since I do approximately zero damage to Havel. I need to remember I cannot afford to get hit by him even once. It's an insta-kill at this point. My level and everything is low enough. Hi, buddy. Here he comes. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I'm running up here to see what happens. What happened? Did he get stuck down there? Did he get stopped? Did Sims take care of it? Um, he's a uh, kind of a he's a different kind of boss than usual boss. It's a it's a very interesting uh, plot thing. The fact that he's down here on his own. Oh darn it! Bad timing, Lauren. Jeez. Oops. Okay, well, I'm about to be out of fireball, so I might as well. Yeah, if somebody else can explain and chat what the deal is with Havel and his significance here. Sometimes um, people in the world go go crazy. It's called going hollow. And so sometimes there'll be people that you've spoken to and then you go back where they usually are and they're like this and they fight you. <sighs> oh boy. Thank you, Sims. I really need to get better at this. I was trying, I'm trying to, I'm still trying to backstab. Yes! I got one! Okay, that's my first backstab on Havel. I'm participating in this fight. Although, to be fair, I did throw some, uh, I did throw some fireballs at him, so that was a participation as well. Oop! We are definitely too low level to be fighting him. 
Uh, honestly, MPO, I would say that the earlier part of the game is hard was harder for me because I had. Oh! Darn it! I didn't think he was gonna hit me. I thought he was going after Sims. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I mean, I should just be two-handing anyway, because my shield does me no good. Alright. Sorry, friends. Let's try that again, shall we? Ugh. Part of me wants to... Probably dib, honestly. I'm low enough level. I'm gonna die just trying to level up here. But yeah, so for me, the early part of the game was really hard because I had no idea what I was doing. Everything was really intense. Um, I was overwhelming. It was scary. I didn't know how to play the game. Unsupported characters in your Steam name. You troublemaker. Well, the thing is, once I got over the, like, intimidation factor of it being Dark Souls, and once I got less overwhelmed by it and started to figure out the general idea of it, it's actually probably the most intuitive, well-designed game I've ever played. Like, I've never been somebody who's like, I can't wait to play a challenging thing. Um... Anyway, sorry guys, if this grinding is borrowing to you. Boring? Borrowing. I, I saw the word reverse hollowing. And my brain autocorrected that. A gorilla. Alright. Yeah, this little gang right here. Aw, somebody kindled the fire for me. Very nice of them. Yeah, like, I wouldn't be having really any trouble at all, except that I'm insisting on sequence breaking, essentially, at this point. Fighting Havel at this point in the game is kind of ridiculous. Um, oops. Oh, well, I wanted to level up, but... Okay, well, we're, we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. Come on, buddy. Come here, buddy. Yeah! Buddy, 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 buddy! Bam, bam! So I don't even know what I should put points in. Because Vit's not going to do me any good against Havel. You know? I mean, I guess doing slightly more damage would make a difference. Which at this point, would that be dexterity or would that be strength or what? Please help me strategize, friends. <laughs> yeah, Flutie Bot is popping into my brain. Oh, that's a good question. Axes scaling. Okay, let's see if I can remember how to do this. Okay. I'm so used to having it go to the lore screen that I like automatically go past here. Strength. My strength is starting to overflow. Sorry. You just have to deal with me randomly quoting, like, badly voice acted games. So how do you tell what it scales with? 
param bonus. Oh, that's the strength is a C and the dexterity is a D, right? Oh, improving your weapon level won't do much. But I don't have the option to improve my weapon level. I was quoting from Star Ocean 2. Okay. The most juicy lore. Well, the thing is, most games I don't consider having lore. They have story, and you like figure out the story and the characterization. The kind of game like this where you have to piece things together is, I think, rather unusual. Well, what should I level up? Should I level up strength then? Okay, we're gonna do it. Is it CB? It might just be the kinds of games that I play then. This guy is so proud of himself. He's kind of like the, uh, the, uh, skeletons from, uh, the catacombs. Right, I don't have unlimited endurance. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get better at backstabbing. <laughs> Are you serious, Armor Gorilla? Yeah! That was a backstab, my friends. I did a backstab. Oh wait, no wonder I can't summon friends. I don't have skin. Oh yeah. That's a big hike. I don't think I want to do that. I don't want to walk all the way back through here. Oh, wait. Oh my god, I'm really bad at this. CB objects to the technicality of the term backstabbing. I've watched the movie that you're supposed to watch before you play Final Fantasy 15. And we may play Final Fantasy 15 at some point. On a Tuesday stream. Oh man, I've got friends to choose from. Didn't angry you guys. So who have we got? Whoa, there's a whole bunch of people. Okay, well that answers that. <laughs> I'm sorry. It looks like that's not gonna happen, unfortunately. <laughs> oh my god, I'm a gorilla. Why does my game dislike you? <laughs> That's tragic. Well, now we know that if we ever need to cause some sort of a... I like Metroidvanias. I don't like side-scrolling platformers in general. So I've got to wait until I can summon friends again. So I will go fight a dude while I wait for friend summoning. So do the um do the hollows um the hollow mini bosses do their does their health scale um if you have multiple people? Okay. Well, that's good. Then we're definitely going to have three of us. So now I've got to wait a little bit until I can summon you guys and spin around in circles. Which game is Dead Cells? We're going to dance. Dance, 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 dance. 
dance, 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 yeah. Yeah, I don't know that the Mega Ten games are really for me. <clears throat> no, but I mean, like, what kind of setting is it? Is it is it a science fiction story? Is it? Why can't I summon friends? No, I'm gonna go talk to the. I'm gonna go reset, reset, reset. Dark fantasy, but with snark. Oh, okay. Where is it? so? I assume. I mean, I assume that I'm waiting for it to realize that I can summon, right? I assume that at some point people's names will pop up here, right? Hollow Knight is on sale right now. My Steam isn't connected to the network? Oh, did you see me dancing like a cool person, Sertaki? Looks like we're gonna grind a little bit. By accident. All right. Well, yeah, I've heard Hollow Knight is really good. People have told me it's like Dark Souls, but with bugs. They're like, it's sad, it has lots of lore, it's really good and well designed. And bugs. Oh, hey! Sims! Alright. Is anybody else up here that I should look for? No, but I, I do like I do like Metroidvanias. I enjoy them. I have played both Super Metroid and um I got an 87% completion my very first time through Super Metroid um, when I'd never played a game like, like that really before. Um, yay! You made it! Um, and I've played all the way through both castles in uh, Symphony of the Night. Metagun! Okay! It'll be your first time with us! Are you ready to go fight Havel? I keep wanting to call you Megaton. I'm sorry. Oh my god. Oh my god, we're making this guy dance. Dance, dance, dance. Blues, could you put another two deaths on the on the thing? Okay. You'll never guess why I died. Wait, where is Metagun? Did you make it through? Or do we have to go back and get you? Okay, well, we'll try again later. Darn it! Summoning failed. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, I'm having a hard time here. Hold on. All right. I could be super fashionable and dress as one of those guys. All right. Well, I'll give you another try in a bit. We just gotta take out these uh these fire throwing jerks. Not to be confused with me throwing fire, because I'm not a jerk. If, if I'm not careful, I will totally 
Oh, Sir Taki, do you want to come with us then? I found you. See if we have more luck with you than we did with Metagun. Not Megaton. Mm -hmm. Did that not work? Hold on. We'll go back through and see if we can. Mm. Okay, we're going to go back. Archer Tower, huh? Yes, Caller, you got it right. I don't know what level I am. Seven, I think. Maybe eight. Archer Tower. Is this, is this the Archer Tower? I don't see any other. Oh, there's one. There's somebody. All right, friend, who are you? Metagun, okay. We'll see if this goes. Honestly, I'm just going to keep trying to summon you guys until one of you actually shows up. Why has my computer started making that noise? It'll be like, you got a message from something. Yeah, and we're trying to... Hey, Double Doc! Oh, thank you! Yes, I did! I beat it, and now we're, we're not doing a new game plus, because I wanted to see how much better I was um, at the game. Uh... <laughs> I picked the master key this time at people's recommendation, and we've been trying to take out uh, Haffle <laughs> at level 8. Because <laughs> apparently I'm secretly... Uh... Oh, this tower! Apparently I'm secretly... Yes, Haffle before Taurus Demon, that's right. I, I don't know. Oh, here we go, here we go. Touch summon sign. Okay, so Taki. No, we got you. We got you. Cross your fingers that I can summon somebody else because I would love to have friends. Having friend plural is pretty great. And Sims has been tremendously helpful in our quest. To there we go. Look at that. See, this is that's the spirit. Boogie, boogie, boogie. Yes! Yes! Two friends. Two friends. Two friends. Two friends. Two friends. Two friends. Yay! All right, let us go and do this, friends. Oh, man. Right, I do not have the stamina that I'm used to thinking I've got. Level 8 is a little different. <laughs> ha! That guy thought he could get me. But I saw him. I saw through his dastardly schemes. Well, I'm excited and welcome for to your uh, if this is your first live Dark Soulsing. <laughs> oh no! Don't die! Oh my God! Did you did you did you get hurt, friend? Are you hurt? Oh no, Sir Taki. Okay, well, let me heal us both. There we go. Look at that! Look at how healed we are. So good. All right, friends, let's do this. Let's backstab Havel so that at level 8 we have sequence broked. I'm mad with power. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, he's coming. Yes, I started Dark Souls um, January of 2017. I have taken a lot of... Uh, Ooh. All right. Oh my god. I I took a lot of breaks over the over the months. Okay, so it's generally smart to uh, roll and if you're even remotely in his vicinity just in case. When he swings. 
Oh my god, okay. I'm gonna try, CB! I'm gonna try! Wait, what? Did we do it? No, okay. Somebody, one of us got hit. I forgot about this. So I'm trying to keep Sims alive. All right, I've got to, I've got to do this. I've got to do this. Yes, I did it! I did it! I did it! I did it! I got one! I got one! Oh, he just kind of forgot what he was doing. Oh, Havel, buddy. Yes, no time has passed. I have spent literally half of my dark s er, literally half of my streaming career. Oh, I was gonna give that one a try. Obviously, I failed. Oh man. Sims, you're so fearless. I wanna be fearless, but if I die, the game is Oh man, you are living dangerously, friend. Woof! <sighs> Not quite enough. Yeah, MPO, I, uh, I've been streaming the same day and time for <laughs> that whole time. Hey, I delete- I, I delivered the final blow! <laughs> I did 14 damage! <laughs> oh, Metagun, you were there waving, huh? Oh my god. Whew. All right, Sims, I'm going to initiate. Hold on. We're going to start um let me see if we can let me see if we can do a, a high five. Let's let's do let's do a point up at the same time. Okay. I'm going to try this. And I am so delighted by that. <laughs> oh, that's true, Jobber. The time zone has changed. Okay. <laughs> Look at how cool we are. Whoo, boy. Okay, so I can't do this. Oh, wait. I can't go through there, but I opened it. Okay. I did, MPO. <laughs> Thanks, Caller. I, I, I moved to Pennsylvania and have been working as a freelancer because the job here did not work out. Um... So, but uh, I've been here since November-ish, but I honestly have taken a lot of time off streaming, which I feel bad about. I would rather not have taken that time off, but all right, Sartaki, do you want to come hang out with us? Shall we go fight the Crispy Knight? How do you feel? Do you feel like you could fight a Crispy Knight, Sims? Let's see if Sartaki can join us. Yes! All right. All right. Oh, 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 
we're trying to do the we're trying to do a high five. Got it. Okay. Although actually that's kind of weird. Let's not do that. Let's come up with something else we can do. We should have a secret handshake. Maybe point down can be our secret handshake. What do you think? I like that. Let's do that. Better chance of getting drops. Okay, so you guys are dead. All right, there you are. Wait, 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 is he crispy? I don't think he's crispy. Is he a crispy? Are you a crispy? Oh. Oh, I can do that. I can, I can get him. I can get him from behind. Oh. Okay. Oh my god, this shield is so good. I'm so glad I got it. It's awfully crowded in here. Let's see if I can do this. How is he hitting me? I was like back here. Okay, well, whatever. Backswing hit me. Oh man. We are destroying this section. Blue tear stone ring. So I don't know honestly if I want to play through the whole game on this. Yeah, no black knight weapon for me. That's okay. I don't feel like I really need it. Oh my gosh. So should we go fight the boss friends or should we do something else? I should probably spend my nine ninety five billion uh, XPs on some levels. The power is exhilarating indeed. There's only the there's only the bonfire back, right? There's no bonfire forward, right? Hmm. That's true, Walliard, you're right. I should try to take this is the one boss that I didn't get to take on by myself. This is the boss. This is the boss that um that Android defeated in one blow with the corn dog. So I think I'm going to go ahead, if you guys don't mind, I'll level up. Um, so thank you. Oh, oh, yes. Okay. There we go. Secret handshake. <laughs> All right. Thank you, friends. Is there, you don't have to jump off things. Okay. Oh my God. They're trying to see how fashionably they can jump off. Nicely done, friends. Nicely done. We're gonna level up vitality, endurance, more vitality. Yeah, he was an interesting challenge. <clears throat> so actually I probably should go ahead and shut down because it's 10 p.m. and I still have some things I need to try to get done like, I have to try to finish a freelance thing in time for tomorrow morning and all of that. Yeah, no, I remember, like, I didn't even, I don't even remember what the Taurus Demon looks like as a boss. Um, I know I fought the Taurus Demon in, it's, it's Isolith, but, uh, not, uh, not here because Ant just smashed it. All right, friends. So I, so so next Thursday, we will not be streaming because the Flutie Pies meetup is that weekend. And Thursday, I'm gonna go up and stay with Brenneman, and we're gonna plot and make things happen. Um, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday are the days of the meetup. We will be um, either doing a Discord chat or we will be streaming if people there are comfortable streaming. We can also have it be where those of us who are comfortable streaming can be in one room, and anybody else can be off camera if they want to. Um, we're going to probably do it during the day, so, uh, on the weekend, um, during our day, so that the maximum number of people can, can tune in. So, like, if you're in Europe, it won't be at 3 in the morning, and if you're in the U.S., it won't be while you're at work. Yeah, um, we're having a meetup, a Flutie Pies meetup. There's going to be, I think, 11 of us, maybe 12, staying in an Airbnb, um, and having grand, crazy adventures. So, um, 
it's uh it's gonna be fun I don't know if we're gonna do Dark Souls the Thursday after that so like pop in the discord and let me know what you think um like let me know if you're like we would really like to see you destroy Dark Souls um get the bits of lore that you didn't get well you know I might go to Japan this year so maybe I'll go to Europe next year um you never know um what kind of crazy uh crazy adventures I wind up having in my life um but yeah, so like, let, let me know if you want to, um, like, if, if, if we should go ahead and move on to Talos Project, do something we haven't done, or if we want to, like, see how long it takes to rebeat Dark Souls, do I want to get out of my system? I don't know. I don't know if this might have gotten out of my system for the time being. Um, or maybe I, I, we have one more session in which I, like, destroy the Taurus Demon and cap things off. I don't know. Um, yeah, um... And we might we might have a big lore a big lore pile. Who who knows? There's there's a billion pop pop possibilities, a billion popularities. I don't know where that word came from. Oh man, yeah, marching band is is is, is crazy fun though. Um, if you have a good band director, it does Sertaki. Although I have noticed that um, because I only play games once a week, I'm super psyched about them when I beat them, and I want to replay them a couple of days after I beat them but by the time the week rolls around sometimes uh, some sort of it's not quite worked yeah head parasites indeed um yeah no I know it I know sims so that's why I'm not sure that I'm gonna actually play through it or if I just kind of wanted to see and feel what a difference it makes and it really does like even without having friends helping and obviously getting Havel on level eight is is something I could only do with friends help I might be able to do it on my own. Um, it would take a lot of tries, but I could do that. That's true, and I could play with people off stream if I wanted to. Um, so, um, so oh man, Pit, very nice. Uh, but uh, but I uh, yes, friends or patients or both. Um, but yeah, no, maybe we could be like, okay, now we're gonna play some Dark Souls. Um, so that might be that might be good. I just I feel like tonight I got um I I, I got some confirmation of things that I wanted to know. <laughs> That's true, Dib. Well, what should I go and fight the Taurus demon right now? Should we go do that? Should we go fight the Taurus demon right now so that this can be the end of our stream? Should we do that? <laughs> or should we hold off and talk to Sol Soler again? Okay. Okay, well, fine. If you guys are excited about this, who am I to tell you no? Okay, fine. The YouTube is going to be like, what are you doing, Lauren? I'll have to put a note that says, by the way, it goes on. Yeah, solo, obviously. Yeah, no, that's true. The only reason to not solo is if I wanted to uh, have help getting to the boss, but I don't need that help. Okay, so I can't quite kill that guy in three hits, but it's close. Oh, I might get invaded at some point. <laughs> oh, Twinkle Toes! Oh, Jobber, thank you! Oh man, I'm so delighted by the bits, bits, bits. Oh, right, yes, I gotta spend my souls. I thought I spent my souls. I guess I didn't spend all my souls. Wow, I guess I got lots of souls. Okay, well, in that case, holy crap. I just, like, doubled my level. Should we go first? I guess it doesn't really matter. Okay. All right, well, there you go. We did beat Havel in a Black Knight. No, that's true. This buddy is so proud of himself. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna solo it, CB, because 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 of the corn dog, the corn dog incident. <laughs> Can let Android know. Oh man, that guy really wanted to get me. Yeah, it was definitely kind of overkill to uh, do Havel already, but... Oh, 
Oh, jeez. Am I gonna die here? I'm gonna die here! Holy crap! Okay, I'm not gonna die here. I know, right, Sertaki? That would be awfully nostalgic. Yeah, we thought about be like I thought about shutting down. Who is oh my gosh. Blues, you look super cool with this character. Yeah, I figured that was blues. Enemy ahead, yes. Come on, buddies. <laughs> oh my god, this guy's like, don't worry guys, I'll go check it out. <laughs> oh, what? I didn't realize he had fire too. <laughs> okay, this is not going as well as I'd hoped. Oh, hey! Short sword. That sounds useful. Jeez. Oh, well. <clears throat> let's... Sorry about that, guys. Um, you're gonna hear this. Oh, hello! You've got the high ground, but I hit you in the face with my axe anyway. Well... Yeah, I might wind up wanting help getting there. That's not so great. Yeah, I might switch to the short sword. Oh, hey, this dude came down to fight me. Where is he? I saw you, buddy. I saw you. I see you. Oh, what? Why do you have fire bombs, you jerk? Jerk. I disapprove. Yeah, I might, I might, maybe I'll get an escort service to, uh, to walk me down to, uh... Oh, okay. My stats aren't good enough. Well, would you guys be willing to, do you guys mind if I get an escort coming here? Just because apparently I'm a... Apparently I'm having trouble. Okay. I mean, it's not like I don't have the humanity to do it, so. Let's do it! Yeah, we were actually going to, uh... Oh, I'm not hollow. Oh. Well. Uh. Oh, you're right! Level up! Oh my god, I'm being so sloppy! Do I need to have higher strength? What do I need for the sword? Let's see, what are the sword's requirements? <laughs> Dexterity 10. Okay, yeah, I can do that. Okay, now I can I can equip the sword. Do I have friends that I can summon? Oh, there's somebody I can summon. I bet that's blues. Oh my gosh. Well, apparently people are tagging me and things online and that's why I'm getting this notification. No, Proto, I'm 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 borrowing help to uh to get me to there. And then I'm going to fight the boss solo because I didn't get to do that first time around <laughs> because of the corn dog incident. 
so. Maybe. Hmm. All right. All right, you can run with your shield out. I forgot about that. I'm kind of failing a little bit. Oh, wow. You just, like, slipped in there and were like, bye, bad guy. And the bad guy was like, oh. I don't think it's the weapon that was the problem. I think it was the Lauren. I'm also not being as cautious as I should be. Oh, wow. You made that guy go all bloody. Oh, should blues not be that awesome? Oh my god. Why do I have four soft humanity? How did that happen? It's these guys right here I'm really bad at. I had a really hard time with them first time around. You have to kick them to make them drop their shields. Okay. But I kicked him! Oh, so they give you a lot of soft humanity early on because you haven't had a chance to get hard humanity. Got it. That makes sense. Oh, before the boss in an area is dead. Okay, so to kind of like make it so that you can, I guess, kind of farm humanity in a way so that you can have a chance to get, um... Oh my gosh, Nox. Oh my gosh, Nox, you're in your box. All right. Oh, right. I think we did this one. Does it come back? No. We got it. It, it jumped off and we smashed it. All right. I think I'll take it from here. Nox in a box is a meow, meow, meow. Who's your baby? Hello, baby. You're a kitty. All right. I have no idea what this guy is like because I had like three seconds to fight him. Wait, isn't there a dragon? Wait, is this not where the boss is? I thought this is where the boss was. Well, that didn't go so well. <laughs> I thought I could get between his legs. Poop. All right, Lauren. Run, 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 run! Okay, so that's not gonna work. Clearly, you cannot run between his legs the way you can with other ones. Oh, jeez! He went right through my shield! Oh my god, I am doing no damage to him. Where am I? Okay. Well, this might take a while. So how do you take out the archers? All right, well.
Oh, darn it! You! Okay, well, I guess that guy's gonna come up here. Let's see if I can do this on my own. Can I be a full grown Lauren? Okay, Lauren, back up. Be smart. Take your time. You can do this. You've done this before. You've done harder things, Lauren. You can do this. We'll see if I can, actually. I'm not 100% sure that I can. Yeah, the fireballs are good. Speaking of... Jerk. Ah! Oh my god. Huh. Yeah, well I think I'm not being cautious enough in some ways. I might be getting impatient, honestly. I might be tired. I haven't been getting enough sleep lately and... Today I've been kind of struggling a bit with the freelance work that I've been doing because I'm I'm doing a lot of writing in one field. Okay. And so like There's gonna be all these hollow soldier Underwears. Oh, hello. Uh. Yeah, well, kicking, I was reminded that kicking is a thing that I can do. Because I can't really parry very well, but I can kick better. Oh, Proto, you missed the, uh, the uh, adventure of my right bumper stopping working. Okay. Oh, hey, I see. Yes. Hello, you jerks. Oh my god. Well, that was not the best that I've ever done. Praise the sun indeed. Well, that'll make this a little bit easier. It's still going to be hard, but... What if you can come up here and throw things on his head? That seems like it would be satisfying. Yeah, Havel was definitely, like, edge of your seat. And the only way we could do any damage at all was to backstab. Run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. Oh my god, oh my god, Lauren. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Flapping my hand totally, totally. <laughs> My god. The fact that I didn't fall to my death immediately. There was amazing. Whoo! Wrong.
Okay. Whoop! <sighs> Darn it! This guy is not Anakin. Did that even damage him? Missed, okay. Well, that's that. Okay. Oh, geez, if you step on his foot, he damages you. Well, that's good to know. Kicks you. Boop. Boop. Darn it. Victory achieved! <sighs> I suppose that is the final boss of this playthrough. So I run forward. Yeah, you might think I would get his drop because I've got um, so many humanities, but... Weakness roll. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoever wrote this? <laughs> Somebody was talking about whether um, things have ever made them laugh out loud. That was wonderful. That's true. Need humanity. Why do you need humanity? There's the dragon that's over there. Hello, friend! Ah, hello. You don't look hollow, far from it. I am Soler of Astora, an adherent of the Lord of Sunlight. Now that I am undead, I have come to this great land, the birthplace of Lord Gwyn, to seek my very own son. <laughs> Do you find that strange? Well, you should. No need to hide your reaction. I get that. Find his very, very own son. <laughs> Solaire? Oh, aha. 
So I didn't scare you. I have a proposition, if you have a moment. Yes. The way I see it, our fates appear to be intertwined. In a land brimming with hollows, could that really be mere chance? So what do you say? Why not help one another on this lonely journey? Uh, yes, of course. It pleases me greatly. Well then, take this. All We're right. Strange beings in a strange land. The flow of time itself is convoluted. With heroes centuries old phasing in and out. The very fabric wavers and relations shift and obscure. There's no telling how much longer your world and mine will remain in contact. But use this to summon one another as spirits, cross the gaps between the worlds, and engage in jolly cooperation. Of course, we are not the only ones engaged in this, but I am a warrior of the sun. Spot my summon signature easily by its brilliant aura. If you miss it, you must be blind. <laughs> oh man, so that's why you keep coming across heroes but then they're dead. It's not that they die between you fa like encountering them here and then they walk over there and die. You encounter a past version of them and then later you come across their fallen body and some amount of time has passed between the two. That makes oh, so much sense. Hello there. I will stay behind to gaze at the sun. The sun is a wondrous body, like a magnificent father. If only I could be so grossly incandescent. So he wants to become the sun. Yeah, no, that makes sense, Wallard. I need to find myself a bonfire. <sighs> That's not going to go very well for me, though. <coughs> Croissant, yeah. <laughs> That's fair, Sitaki. But I think the implication, at least within like the context of the world, is that through summoning, you wind up in each other's worlds. So. That's going to be really hard to get to. Is this even possible to do? Like, isn't that, is that what I'm supposed to do? Oh! It's on the left side there, isn't it? I think right side. Okay. Yeah, just in just in case they're talking. Ah, that is helpful. Oops. Kick ladder. Right. The dragon behaves differently depending on whether you have the ladder to the bonfire kicked down or not. How so, Metagon? A fun sword might be fun, but... Drake, dragon. Whew! Oh, oh, we should level up. I definitely need endurance. That is a problem that I keep running into. Oh, and then after that it's just like, nope, none for you. That's fair. Okay, well... That was exciting and goes to show that you can, in fact, still have... Um, yeah, I mean, it's an extremely well-designed game, so that's not surprising. So I think I did okay, given that I've never <laughs> never fought that guy before because of the corn dog incident. Um, so that was exciting. Uh, I think I only died once to him and then figured out what to do. Things like 
um, minding your endurance, which is not something I'd had to deal with because my endurance had been so high before. Um, so minding your endurance um, so that you don't take damage when he attacks you if you're shielding. <laughs> yeah, well. Thank you guys. This time for real. I'm actually going to quit the game for now. We may come back later. We may have a lore stream. We may play a bit off stream. Might be fun. We might have like a random stream where I'm like, hey, summon me. But yeah, no, that was that was good. And then again, remember, next week we have off. And um, then I guess we'll dive into Talos Principle. Talos Project? Talos Principle? That game, I think, we'll, we'll play. Um, because a lot of people here seemed interested in it. Um, and we'll see how it goes. Um, we might be doing something different. Um, I think we might be nearing the end of Crisis Core, so I don't know exactly what's coming next on Tuesdays, but um, something might be. So if you don't watch Tuesday because you don't care about Crisis Core, that might be up, um, up for grabs. So yeah, thank you guys so, so much. It was lovely to have you all. And um, yes, good night. Have a good weekend, everybody. Bye.